Hello and welcome to the Terror of the Firat. We are here on Yurik, our uh, heroic beast lord. And uh, so we did not grab all the mercenary quests. This one is one I missed. And uh, I wonder, we're going to do this one today. And uh, we're here at Lurg. He is right, uh, right here. So here's the POK book. He's like in these little houses over here. So let's go ahead and uh, see what he has to say. He goes, hey, 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 oh, gorilla strong, make big boom when walk now. Me want to barsh them all. He, 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 barsh. You like to barsh too? It's like a game. Take a club, hit them right in the head. Boom, they fall over. Then they make good food. He, he, he. It's a game? You want to join in the game? Ooh, he he he. Go barsh me some gorilla monkeys for eat. Barsh them flat, then bring good meat, no dead, decay meat, good meat. Join. I will join your game. And that gives us meat for eat. Which doesn't really say anything. He says, good, good, bring meat to eat. We need to go kill uh, two gorilla matrons, search the corpses, kill seven Gorilla Patriarchs and gather a Gorilla Meat times three. All right, so it looks like the Gorillas spawn over here. Uh, there's a Blighted, Festerback, some names we might get to deal with, so that's going to be fun. I don't know if they're undead or not, so we'll see. Let's go ahead and head over here. Rank two spells. Interesting. Uh, I did pick up this, uh, sp I think this is a uh, rank 2 spell item. Uh, you have to give it to somebody, I just can't remember who. <laughs> so we'll figure that out at some point. From one of the names we did kill. There are the gorillas there. They are level 86, so I need to find a way over there. Without being destroyed in this river. Oh, what the hell? Wow, oh, what a <laughs> sea serpent. Uh, sees right through uh, Invis and uh, whatever. So let's kill him real quick. Jeez. But uh, we are currently 14% into the level, so leveling at a good pace. I think we might actually, uh, could we could in theory out level this expansion fairly quickly. And uh, I think what we'll do, uh, we might turn AA experience on at 90 just to kind of slow it down, depending on how uh, how this goes. Uh, so that's something we may do. Jeez. These are a little bit rougher than uh, some of the other mobs we've fought so far. But again, they all die the same. All right, I'm going to invis again. Maybe I was not invis before. Uh, can we tab target that one? So now that one can't see us, so I guess uh, I was uninvis when uh, I talked to that guy and I didn't reinvis. All right, so here's a gorilla, a gorilla patriarch. He's an even con, so we'll see how this goes. I'm gonna pull a slow, uh, send the pet, and get over right next to him. Gonna put some dots on him. Ah. Uh, Icon. I think EQ uh, Freelance was like, don't use dots, but I think that's in a raid situation. I can't see why I wouldn't want to use these <laughs> these dots. Uh, they do actual pretty good damage. Uh, I only have the disease one on right now, but it's 17. Uh, I guess I resisted the poison dot. Let's see if I can get it on there. There we go. So it crit right away for 12k, which is pretty good for right, for this level, right? 
Uh, both dots are insta-cast, so definitely something I try to cast on every mob. And normally that's like 1500 and 3400, respectively for the disease and the uh, stuff, so not bad. And we're actually able, I mean, these things hit harder than like the Avatar War, so they hit pretty hard. Uh, all things considered. All right, we're going to take the meat. This looks like vendor fodder, so we'll take that. Make some money. There is another one. So, Mercenary did pretty well. Let's go ahead and pull him. Oh, two. Somehow we got both those feign deaths off. There we go. Split. Slowed. Not yet. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Slowed and... Dotted. There we go. Perfect. And the way I have my uh, spam nuke, just in case anybody's curious, I do three, two, four, five. So, uh, venom, bite, uh, torrent, and lance. And if I hit the button fast enough in that order, I'll be able to cast all four of the spells. So it works out pretty well. Uh, and then I have uh, the dots on their own little macro here. I could probably put them all into a slow one, but I kind of like having slow separate for pulling. But, uh, yeah. And then I do, uh, I do my, uh, my pet attack actually casts, uh, it t well, tells, the, you know, queue up the attack, queue up the swarm, and then cast nine, which is, uh, Harrigan's Phralgia. Which is the pet swarm spell, so... So far, it's uh, working out pretty well. Uh, if anybody has any better suggestions on that, let me know. And he is slowed, and I'm gonna dot him up now. Uh, so what do we gotta do here? We gotta... Search the corpses. Okay, so we're killing them. And I don't know if I'm missing something here. Search the corpse thing. I thought we'd kill more than two of them so far. But, uh, yeah. And we just need one more meat. And uh, I think that'll, uh, this is a, actually a pretty easy quest. I don't, I missed it in my original. Uh, listing for these, so. Trying to knock out all the mercenaries, then we'll do the partisan quests. Uh, this is the other one right here. Uh, silence them by killing 16 of them, so that's just gonna be a, a bit of a time consuming one. Alright, um. Yeah, that counted. What do we got over here? We got a. Another gorilla? Who killed a camp? Let's pull him. And I guess he, uh, the mercenary healed me at the same time. Alright, let's go get in there. I like to cast focus on me as much as possible, but, uh,. I don't know how much effort that actually gives us in combat. But it's a pretty good spell, all things considered. And then I have uh, Chameleon Strike right here. It's just that plus Disc 4A. Uh, and then I have that on a timer, Disc 4A. Uh, Right here, Assault of Fury attacks, which is like a little extra damage. And then, uh, 
That's about it, really. Nothing too complex. That thing died. Apparently, I'm like finishing everything because <laughs> the way they the AAs work, they just give you uh, all the all the stuff pretty much. All right, let's get him. Probably could have waited on mana, but he is slowed. So he might be a slower kill. Let's see if I can stand here without getting mad. Yeah, we don't have enough mana, so I'm gonna probably med up up med up after this. Uh and then I guess we'll, I'll, what I'll do is I'll go find these gorilla matrons, the female gorillas, wherever they're at, and uh, probably just kill the uh, rest of the patriarchs. And then we'll jump in when we get there, just to cut on video time, because uh, it is a mercenary quest. Uh, it will be done fairly quickly. But it, literally this spot is solo pullable. There's some young gorillas over there, so I'm guessing that's a matron. And that's probably what we're gonna have to deal with is like some young ones so it's gonna be like a, an aoe pull but we'll we'll met up and figure that out There we go, and that is the last meat we needed, so that's good. So I'm going to med up and uh, kill the other two um, patriarchs we need and look for matrons. I'm assuming we just found one anyway, so uh, we'll have to go check out that here in a second. But uh, yeah, be right back. All right, I got close enough to the rock <laughs> that I got uh, only two of the three. So definitely uh, doable, I think. I'm just going to burn down the gorilla, the young one. I uh, didn't put any dots on him. Let's see if I can put dots on her. Oh, she didn't slow. Good thing I checked. There she goes. She's slow, so there we go now. I'm perfect. Oh, am I taking both of them now? Come on. Come on, Warder. You need to uh, get to work here. Oh, God. They're hitting hard. Look at that mercenary. is uh, definitely uh, saving us here. Mercenary is the clutch of uh, the solo game. Alright, one down. And the Twisted Gorilla Hand is a, a a vendor fodder item. Alright, this looks like Poison didn't land. And then the, the other uh, matron is right over here on a little sandbar that I could find. I saw anyway. All right. Yeah, she's right over there. She has two, uh, two youngins. Uh, there's another one right over there on the other side of that rock. Somehow I didn't aggro it. Oh, what is that? That's a patriarch. So let's go ahead and uh, I'm gonna have to med up again. <laughs> I took pretty much full. I was at full mana when that or took down to forty. So do that, and uh, we'll kill this last me ma uh, matron, and we'll be done with the quest.
All right, I just spent probably 15 minutes trying to uh, solo pull this guy here. This is uh, the named Festerback. Uh, we're going to go ahead and water protection on him. Fortify companion and all that nonsense. And we're going to turn on burns. And we're going to go to town here. There we go. Just to get him burned as soon as possible. Because uh, there is a mob that spawns right here where we're standing. Uh, that's pretty pretty strong. And we're getting tanked. <laughs> Jeez. used uh, Warder's Gift. There we go. Chameleon Strike finally worked. Uh, it's kind of... Chameleon Strike works like an evade. Uh, just wasn't... I was doing too much damage. <laughs> go. All right. And we get our first piece of armor, I believe. Yeah. This is Tier 1 Arms. And we got a Mask, which uh, isn't going to be an upgrade, I don't believe. But this is a tunable. Yeah, it's probably the same Mask. It's like one, you know, one little bit better, but uh, we're going to sell that. Uh, we'll probably make the arms so we can make the tier two arms. So uh, that'll be a thing we have to do because I don't think heroic armor start counts for that. But I'm over here uh, we're in this part of the zone. I was just looking around to see if there was more matrons, but there is not. They all spawn over by the water. So I'm going to... Go over there, and we're going to get our last matron. All right, we have, uh, we got the pool. <laughs> I tried to unmute, but I was already unmuted. All right, so there we go. I'm going to kill the, uh, the young one first. Just because, uh, these are real mobs. They're not, I thought they'd be weaker, but, uh, they're not. Uh, it's like two levels lower than a normal gorilla, so it's like fighting a uh, lizard man almost. Ah, uh, so definitely uh, something to watch out for. This is the only one I could get two of them. Ah, uh, everyone else I, could, I was getting three. Might help if I turn attack on. Not even sure what that noise was. Oh, I guess I got something there. I don't know. Slowed her right. There we go. Perfect. And the warder's just doing a great job. Like always. Good tanking uh, pet. Really changes the way the game works, I think, honestly. Uh, it's pretty crazy. Liquid Nightmare. Uh, it's for a quest. Let's take it for now. And this matron here will complete the quest. And we can uh, go turn this in with uh, Lurg, I believe it was. Perfect. Let's do some dots on her. I don't know why I had forgot to do that earlier. There we go. I don't know how much damage the uh, single swarm pet does, but uh, it's definitely worth keeping up. All right, task complete. Let's go back to Lurg real quick. All right, we're here at Lurg. Let's go ahead and hail him. And uh, give him the three meats he wanted. All right, so we get to choose here between a uh, face aug with dex and a face aug with strength. We're going to go with the dex, 20 AC, and 80 hit points. That's pretty nice. Uh, and then some faction and experience. 
All right, so let's go ahead and put that in our face slot. The cool thing about these augs is, like, they're, we're going to be getting a, a full set of augs for all the pieces of armor. And we're uh, going to be able to keep those. Uh, it's not like we're limited to this heroic gear. Uh, so as we upgrade stuff, we'll have a good set of augs as we go through all this stuff. So this is going to be nice. I wish I had known about this when I'd uh, done uh, Gnome Regard and I would have done the House of Thule progression. But uh, I didn't know that. And we did <laughs> use a heroic boost on him after we got him to 85. So uh, definitely interesting. But that takes care of um, Meat for Eat, the uh, mercenary task. There's one more mercenary task for the zone, and then we will uh, do the partisan quest. So thank you very much for watching, and have a fantastic day.